George Clooney makes plea for publications not to run photos of his kids, keep our family safe. George Clooney wants the media to help keep his kids safe. In an open letter to the Daily Mail and other publications, the Oscar-winning actor said that because of why for Mal Clooney's job, posting photos of their four-year-old twins could put their safety at risk. Having just seen photos of Billy Lord's one-year-old baby in your publication, and the fact that you subsequently took those pictures down, we would request that you refrain from putting our children's faces in your publication, he begins. I am a public figure and accept the oftentimes intrusive photos as part of the price to pay for doing my job. Our children have made no such commitment. The nature of my wife's work has her confronting and putting on trial terrorist groups and we take as much precaution as we can to keep our family safe," he adds. Amal is a barrister who specializes in international law and human rights. We cannot protect our children if any publication puts their faces on their cover, George continues. We have never sold a picture of our kids, we are not on social media and never post pictures because to do so would put their lives in jeopardy. Not paranoid jeopardy but real world issues, with real world consequences. We hope that you would agree that the need to sell advertisement isn't greater than the need to keep innocent children from being targeted. George and Amal welcomed wins, Ella and Alexander, in 2017. This isn't the first time George has taken issue with the Daily Mail. In 2014, he rejected the outlet's apology for publishing a false story about Amal's mother, calling the paper the worst kind of tabloid. consequences.
We hope that you would agree that the need to sell advertisement isn't greater than the need to keep innocent children from being targeted. George and Amal welcomed wins, Ella and Alexander, in 2017. This isn't the first time George has taken issue with the Daily Mail. In 2014, he rejected the outlet's apology for publishing a false story about Amal's mother, calling the paper the worst kind of tabloid.